Monday, I uh, said to the Prime Minister that uh, I needed some answers to some critical questions and uh, we needed to make progress for Canadians. I said I wasn't seeking an election. I was seeking collaboration, not confrontation. Uh, the Prime Minister took me at his word, uh, sought a meeting with me yesterday afternoon, and uh, we met again yesterday evening, and we're in communication this morning. And as I think you know, I'm pleased to say that we've made two substantial uh, um, gains for all Canadians. The first is uh, that we have agreed to uh, strike a working group uh, which will seek to present to Canadians by September of this year specific legislative proposals to bring the self-employed into the employment insurance system. As you know, they are the largest group of unemployed Canadians who have no coverage. And we think it would be wonderful for Canada if we could find a solution to do that uh, this autumn. Secondly, uh, we agreed uh, that uh, 58 uh, regional standards for employment insurance doesn't make much sense. And that we need to work together to see whether we can find a way get into the law quickly to simplify the, the system in order to improve fairness, access, and equality for all Canadians coast to coast to coast. Uh, the Prime Minister agreed with his objective. We agreed to form this working group. And I've asked uh, Michael Savage, MP for Dartmouth Cold Harbour, and uh, Marlene Jennings of MP for Notre Dame, Notre Grasse Lachine uh, to serve on this committee along with my head of policy Kevin Chan and the Prime Minister will nominate uh, uh, whom he sees fit which I believe will be a minister and uh, plus uh, senior officials. This is all business. This is working to get a result for Canadians by a fixed date. So that's number one. Secondly, and this is equally important to me, uh, I ask, ask questions of the Prime Minister in respect of stimulus spending and deficit. Uh, didn't always get answers that fully satisfied me, but he committed, and this is very important, uh, to deliver a third accountability report to Parliament uh, on or around in the week of the 28th of September. He further agreed to an opposition day in which we could vote further confidence or not depending on what that report contains and depending on whether the uh, working group has produced useful results for Canadians. And so, uh, to sum up, we have found a way to make progress for Canadians on EI and we found a way to hold this government accountable and I feel that this is a, uh, is a good day for our country, but more importantly, it's a good day also uh, for this system of Parliament. We've, we've tried to make it work and I think we're going we're gonna to try and make it work and get good results for Canadians.